straightforward, to the point, more local. Eyewitness News, more local in the morning on Fox 39, starts now. Good morning, it's 8 a.m. I'm Emily Waldron. I'm Jay Leonardi. And I'm meteorologist Ryan Bells. Tracking some showers and storms moving in the forecast. We saw some sunshine early yesterday, and then we saw the increase in clouds overnight and more cloud cover to start off the day today. All right, that's going to be Red Bull time for me. <laughs> Need some energy to get through this rainy day. Yep, I have to have, when it's rainy and cloudy, I'm, I seem to be so affected by the weather. I, yeah, me I could too. nap for days me when too. it's cloudy like that. It's perfect weather. It, it's going to be over the next few days into the first part of the day tomorrow. Clouds will start to decrease, high pressure will build in. Be a lot cooler starting tomorrow, though. Temperatures back down into the low and mid 60s. Oh, grab yeah. that sweater. Grab overnight, that sweatshirt. Overnight lows by the end of the work week, down into the lower 40s, flirting with the upper 30s. So, uh, I don't like yeah. that. Mm -mm. You're not going to like any part of the sun, except for the sunshine <laughs> tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> a little bit of sunshine out there right now. Let's take a look at current conditions. You can see partly sunny skies. A few clouds will start to build in, though, over the next few hours. Temperature in the mid 60s, dew point. Right around 64, it is a little humid. You can feel the moisture in the atmosphere. Winds out of the south at 6 miles an hour. Winds will pick up throughout the day. Gust upwards of 25 miles an hour as that cold front moves in. Gusting close to 30 overnight tonight. You can see the rain off to our west. That will be making its way in. Showers and storms expected. Potentially some strong to severe storms as well as it makes its way throughout the area later on this afternoon and into the early evening hours. Can't rule out some damaging wind and heavy rain potential with these storms. In addition, an isolated chance of a tornado in some areas of hail possible. Can't rule it out. I think the better chance is going to be off to the east over northern portions of Indiana. Today's weather risk, because of the severe storms moving into the area, we're going to keep our weather risk moderate with those showers and storms making their way throughout the area. Bus stop forecast. As the kids are headed off to school, temperatures in the low and mid 60s, mainly cloudy, but then that rain arrives by the time they start to come home from school, right around the 3 4 o'clock hour. We should start to see the rain on our doorstep. Seven day forecast shows cooler weather and drier weather behind the cold front. How long will it last? I'll have details in my full forecast coming up, but you can always track the rain that's moving into the area today using the first worn interactive radar brought to us by Paul Mary and Sun Contracting. You can see the rain off to our west. It's going to be making its way in this afternoon, right around the 3, 4 o'clock hour and lasting through the early evening hours, guys. So make sure you have that umbrella handy. All right, thanks, Ryan.